Africa is a continent with immense potential, and many countries have embarked on ambitious mega-projects to boost their economies and infrastructure. However, not all of these projects have been successful. In this video, we shall take a look at some failed, abandoned, delayed, or uncompleted mega-projects in Africa. We shall look at the Ajokuta Steel Plant, trans gabon Railway, Kanza Tech City, and so much more. So buckle your sit belts because this is going to be a ride of a lifetime. Number 9. Ajokuta Steel Plant, Nigeria A symbol of unfulfilled dreams, this colossal steel complex stands as a stark reminder of missed opportunities. Construction began in 1979, fueled by ambitions of industrialization. Yet, corruption, mismanagement, and funding shortfalls plagued the project from the start. By 1994, it was 98% complete, but political wrangling and lack of funds left it abandoned a rusting monument to wasted resources. Will it continue? The future remains uncertain. In 2019, plans for revival emerged, but funding and transparency concerns linger. A definitive answer hinges on overcoming these hurdles and establishing a clear, sustainable path forward. Possible solutions, a transparent public-private partnership with stringent anti-corruption measures could breathe new life into the project. Additionally, Focusing on specific, achievable goals within the broader vision could attract investment and ensure progress. Number 8. Grand Inga Dam, Democratic Republic of Congo There could be enough electricity produced by this enormous dam to power the entire continent of Africa. But for many years, environmental issues had impeded development, especially those pertaining to community uprooting and ecosystem damage. Financing is a significant concern due to the project's sheer size and political unpredictability. Will it go on? The future appears uncertain. Plans to address environmental concerns have been revised, but there are still major obstacles to overcome in terms of money and political stability. Possible solutions Addressing environmental problems with strong mitigation techniques and community involvement is critical. Furthermore, Gaining international collaboration and financing via green bonds or other funding structures could pave the road forward. Number 7. Trans Gabon Railway, Gabon. This railway aimed to unlock the country's eastern mining riches. However, cost overruns, coupled with doubts about economic viability, led to construction being halted in 2018. Transparency concerns and the impact on indigenous communities further complicated the project. Will it continue? The future remains unclear. The government has expressed interest in reviving the project, but securing funding and addressing transparency issues are crucial. Possible solutions, a revised, scaled-down version focusing on key economic benefits and transparent procurement processes could attract investors. Additionally, ensuring community engagement and addressing environmental concerns will be essential for success. Number 6. Epoe Cement Factory, Ghana this factory had all the makings of a game-changer. Imagine the largest cement factory in West Africa, lowering construction costs and strengthening Ghana's industrial prowess. But somewhere along the way, things went horribly wrong. Accusations of corruption swirled, fingers were pointed, and in 2015, the Ghanaian government halted the entire project, leaving just a half-built ghost of what may have been. So, what comes next? The future of Epwes is unknown. The government has expressed an interest in restarting it, but that depends on addressing corruption concerns and attracting investors who believe in the project's feasibility. Without a clear and well-funded relaunch, Epuace could become a cautionary story. Number 5. Abuja Millennium City, Nigeria Imagine a future city, a brilliant light of modernity, just outside Nigeria's busy capital. That was the vision for Abuja Millennium City. However, dreams, as they frequently do, met with hard realities. Financial difficulties hampered the project, bringing building to a halt and transforming the promised utopia into a symbol of unmet potential. Will Abuja Millennium City ever rise from its ashes? It's difficult to say. The project necessitates a major cash injection and a renewed commitment from stakeholders. Perhaps a public-private partnership could give it fresh life, but without a firm plan and persistent commitment, Abuja Millennium City may remain a blueprint accumulating dust. Number 4. Kanza Tech City, Kenya The goal of this project was to establish Kenya as a technology hub, a haven for creativity and entrepreneurship. The aim was grand, an African Silicon Valley. However, 
the road to tech nirvana proved difficult. Land acquisition difficulties hampered work, infrastructural challenges loomed, and financing, like a fickle companion, threatened to vanish at critical periods. So, is Kanza Tech City doomed to become a digital ghost town? Not in all cases. The Kenyan government is still committed, and recent investments are moving the project forward. However, for Kanza Tech City to actually take off, it will require consistent funding, expedited land acquisition processes, and the attraction of significant tech businesses. Number 3. The Nakala Corridor Imagine a huge corridor snaking through Mozambique, complete with a railway line, a pipeline, and a deep water port, all throbbing with the rhythm of progress. That was the objective of the Nakala Corridor project, which aimed to open the country's interior resources and serve as a global commerce gateway. Funding flowed, construction moved forward, and dreams soared high. But then reality intervened. The global financial crisis created shockwaves, funding dried up, and growth stalled. Cyclone Ida's wrath in 2019 struck further blow, leaving a trail of devastation and additional delays. Today, the corridor is only partly completed, a sobering reminder of how harsh realities may disrupt even the best laid plans. Will the Nakala Corridor ever realize its full potential? The answer is dependent on numerous things. Can Mozambique get the financing it sorely needs? Can the initiative negotiate the complicated political landscape? And, perhaps most crucially, will it address the concerns of local communities affected by its development? Only time will tell if this transportation ambition will rise from the ashes or remain an unfinished chapter in Mozambique's story. Number 2. The Mamabula Mirage Another ambitious project, the Mamabula Coal to Liquids Project, is located deep in Botswana's Kalahari Desert. This daring proposal sought to convert enormous coal deposits into valuable liquid petroleum, ensuring the nation's energy independence and economic success. Millions flowed in, technology was hyped, and expectations were high. But the winds of change started to blow. Environmental worries grew, emphasizing the project's significant carbon burden. The economic landscape transformed, with the global oil market generating shockwaves. Investors became concerned, and in 2021, the dream came crumbling down, leaving a cloud of dust and unresolved questions. Is the tale of the Mumabula project over? Not necessarily. The massive coal reserves remain, and the demand for energy solutions continues. However, the future requires a different strategy. Renewable energy sources are beckoning, promising cleaner and more sustainable options. Perhaps a renewed emphasis on solar, wind, or even hydrogen could revitalize this enterprise, but with a greener, more responsible vision at its center. Number 1. Zambia's Dusty Road Another colossus in Zambia is struggling to make its way. The 720-kilometer Luzaka Dola Solwezi Road will connect Zambia's commercial core to the copper-rich north. However, like a car stuck in neutral, progress sputters and stalls. The road's problems are numerous. Funding constraints leave portions unpaved, with dust floating where asphalt should be. Environmental concerns have stalled building, with detractors citing deforestation and disturbed habitats. Then there's the social impact, relocated communities, lost livelihoods, and a growing disparity between promise and reality. Will this dusty path ever lead to prosperity? The answer is a delicate dance. Zambia must acquire finance, solve environmental concerns, and ensure that communities gain rather than suffer. Transparency and accountability are essential. Without them, the road may remain a monument to failed promises. Despite these limitations, there are numerous successful megaprojects in Africa that are positively impacting the continent's growth. As African countries grow and develop, we should expect to see more ambitious initiatives being attempted. The key to success will be to learn from previous failures and ensuring that these projects are well-planned, well-funded, and carried out in a sustainable and responsible manner. But hey, the story doesn't end here. Hit that subscribe button and join the discussion. Let's talk solutions, share ideas, and be part of shaping a brighter future for Africa's development journey. Remember, the power is in our hands, and together, we can build better giants.